Kana mtami na ito mzee mzee makamadi ya matawali Nikuwa nimekudokezea kwa mbaleo ni siku ya accountability Monday na mgini wangu wa subuhi hii Bwana ya Joffrey Kerosi yuko ndani ya studio kuzungunza masola mengi Tu ambaye na tuhusu mimi na wewe e, katika kipindi cha siku ya leo Kwa hivyo kastan bayi tuna mengi tu Ambaye tumekuwa ndalia katika segment hii ya nene Ya accountability Monday leo Tunaangazia kusiana na mipangilio ya jiji Na tunapuzungunza kusiana na mipangilio ya, ya jiji Tunazungunza kusiana na mipangilio kakati ambazo zimewekwa e, zile ambazo zinaitwa urban planning e, ndio sasa hizo unaona kwamba matatu au taruhusiwi uh, kuingia katikati mwa jiji unatembea kidogo kwa mfano kama unatumia barabara zote za Ngong utashukishwa kule maeneo ya railway yes. kama unatumia barabara ya Waiyaki way e, pengine mwisho wako wa kufika katikati mwa jiji itakuwa ni Serena na not Waiyaki way kama unatumia Uhuru highway mwisho wako ni Serena kama utakuwa unatumia barabara za Waiyaki way then utashukishwa kule fig three kuna ta, kuna lingana na terminus gani kuna terminus a kuna b paka d kulingana na jinsi barabara hizo zilivyopangwa na miongoni mwa masuala mengi tu ambayo itakuwa inaangaziwa kwa ndani zaidi kwa hivyo sana karibu sana bwana Kerosi katika studio zetu asubuhi asante sana e, karibu sana tena mjini Nairobi asante sana bwana Amata yes ndio kumekuwaje kule maeneo ya Mombasa Mombasa ni saizi choto ndio mingi <laughs> Choto ndio mingi sana 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 Karibu sana eh. Tunapuzunguza kusiana urban planning Nini mm. ambacho mwanainja na itaji kujua eh, Mamba ya urban planning Ni vile ambafyo <coughs> Ni vile ambafyo mji unatakana kupangwa Ama wamepanga mji ukue Kuna sehemu mbali mbali katika urban planning Una, unapata vile wanataka ikue kwa mfano eh, wakati wa mwishimi wa kidero wakati alikuwa governor ali tengeneza plan ambayo ilikuwa inaitwa Nairobi Integrated Urban Development Master Plan N I U P L A N hiyo sasa hiyo plan ndio iko na vile Nairobi inatakana kuonekana mm -hmm. into the future Dio. kwa sababu sahihi ukiangalia Nairobi haionekani vizuri sana mm -hmm. eh, kuna congestion mm -hmm. kuna mambo ya even housing Dio. nyumba mba, vile simepangwa unapata even mahali kuna takana kuwa na residential unapata kuna eh, kuna commercial housing yes like uh, abap or a restaurant mm -hmm. iko ndani ya Mahali watu yeah, wanaka eh, ndani ya estate Dio. Pia umeona wakichenga parapara mpia kama Ngong Road Hiyo mm. sasa iko under the new plan The master plan eh, Lakini fide eh, nimefanya analysis ya budget Nimeona ya kwamba Hiyo master implementation of the master plan itakuwa asiro Kwa Kwanini? sababu budget inasema otherwise Unajua wanasiasa wakiongea Wanaongea mambo makubwa makubwa eh, Kwa mfano badai tutangalia hiyo mambo ya master plan Lakini yale ambayo ya kukua budget sasa ndiyo kusema Because if you want to know whether government is committed to something Look at this budget mm -hmm. Hapo ndi utajulia Kuna tafuti kani katia hii master plan na hile eh, eh, plans za kawaide Zile annual development plan kuna CDIP Kuna tafuti kani? Eh, zile annual development plan County integrated development plans Hizo ni sa kifedha Filo unapanga, filo tatumia feather. Dio. Lakini master hapa ni plan, ni kama unajua wakati unajenga nyumba, rasima ukue na hile plan ya nyumba. Mm -hmm. A house plan, eh? Sasa master hapa ni plan, ni hile inaonyesha file, ni nini itakuwa wapi. Kwa mfano Nairobi, ili kutoa congestion, rasima mtu wafikiria in future file tutafanya. Dio. Labda tukue na right railway, ama kukue na underground, something yenye inapita underground, kama, kama like in other developed countries. So it is kind of a, a fiscal plan. Vire yeah. in Nairobi County or Nairobi City taonekana in the future. What would be where? Where would we have, for example, a right rail uh, train? Where would we have, for example, um, uh, roads, major roads which are connecting Nairobi to other uh, big towns? So that is what is in there. Happen development plans mm -hmm. and the Happen development master plan was uh, developed uh, during the regime of uh, Kidero Evans Kidero. Mm -hmm. Na baada ya kidogo tutaangalia the contents lakini nataka kwanza tuanze na budget yenyewe. Mm -hmm. I was surprised wakati niliona kwamba budget ya Happen planning unajua kuna department ya Happen planning. Mm -hmm. Inaitwa Happen planning and runs. Hiyo ni department Na ujua Nairobi County, pesa yake mingi Mbae ikona CC pia Eh yeah, ikona CC Mamba ya runs, hapa ni planning yes. 
uh, I was surprised wakati nikiangalia budget kwamba uh, budget ya urban planning inaendelea kudidimia kila mwaka kuanzia 2016 2017 kwa mfano sasa hizi ni 2018 2019 budget iko 590 million mm -hmm. hii hi pesa ina, tutaangalia inafanya kazi gani number one, inafanya urban planning kwa hivyo ile ile master plan inatakikana kuwa implemented by this department it is it is taking read eh? mm -hmm. aya alafu ukiangalia hiyo budget from the previous years in 2016 2017 budget ilikuwa 748 million ndio last year ikapunguka to 667 million mm hiyo -hmm. ni total budget so is is million there's enough ku, 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 ku implement uh, master plans hizi hii budget unajua kuna wale wafanyikazi wanafanya kwa hiyo department Dio. kama hapa ni planners kuna wale even architects wale watu ambao wanajua mambo ya hapa ni planning wanakaa kwa hiyo department mm -hmm. even engineers wanakaa hapo but those who are in, uh, who are in charge of hapa ni planning those who are in charge of land survey because the town has to be surveyed well mm -hmm. previously before we started thinking about this new urban plan nairobi required to operate an, on a plan which was developed by the uh, colonial masters hiyo plan ina maanisha ni kitamba sana mm -hmm. so you remember like in 1963 what was the population of nairobi we were very few hapa migration started after independence mm -hmm. sababu mzungu hakuwa anataka watu wakuje kukaa tu Nairobi ni wafanye kazi mashambani in fact alikuwa anataka wale peke yake wale wanakuja kumfanyia kazi fulani ndio so the colonial masters never encouraged people to come to Nairobi but after independence there was a new hope of which it was working watu wengekuwa wanafanya kazi kule vijijini eh. tungekuwa saa hizi na chakula tungekuwa na mambo mengi zaidi eh, so, but you know people, eh. people started coming to Nairobi because we we developed a centralized government form yeah. of government meaning everything uh, good was in Nairobi if we are talking about government jobs they were in Nairobi mm -hmm. you could not find them elsewhere because all departments major departments were here in Nairobi mm -hmm. ukitaka birth certificate lazima ikuje kutafutwa Nairobi national id lazima ukuje Nairobi, Nairobi. marriage certificate <laughs> unaoa kule mashinani tuseme kama kakamega Dio. lakini lazima nani akuje kwa attorney general's office Dio. that that is how it used to work and you remember the even the fiscal infrastructure that we used to uh, to operate on like now let us talk about the sewerage system imagine a sewerage system of 5 million people no no not 5 million people nairobi was around less than 1 million people mm -hmm. at that time that is the same same one we are using up to now so there is need i think in this master plan they have talked about how are we going to dispose waste mm -hmm. kwa sababu sasa hizi tuko watu karibu 4.5 million You know the kind of the kind of raw sewerage we produce every day yeah. is a lot and it is reported in the county documents that in Nairobi does not have capacity for example to treat all raw sewerage that mm. we produce in Nairobi yeah. they cannot even uh, process mm -hmm. the solid waste that we produce here in Nairobi mm. Mm. so that is the, that is why the the master the urban plan is very important yeah. this master plan and remember This is the department which should be facilitating what we call security of land tenure. Mm -hmm. That means uh, wakati tu, tu, tu nataka ku, for example kupeana title deeds land has to be surveyed. Yes. Mapping has to be done. You know? mm -hmm. So if we use this department well we can achieve security of land tenure mm -hmm. even for the people living in informal settlements. Yes. And you know that is the solution. Mm -hmm. Why don't people build permanent structures in the informal settlements? Ni kwa sababu hata kama niko na pesa siwezi chenga nyumba nzuri because I don't know when I would be affected from that piece of land. So it is important that this department takes up this role seriously. Yes. All right. Waza tupumue kidogo tupate taarifa za biashara na Frida Okache alafu tunarejea na mengi zaidi. Kumbuka tunazungumza kuhusiana na urban na urban eh, master planning ambayo inapendekezwa hapa jijini Nairobi. Moja wapo ya hizo ni hizo implementation za kupigwa marufuku matatu kuingia katikati mwa jiji la Nairobi. Kwa hivyo ukiona mambo kama haya yanatokea usikuwe mwepesi wa kurusha mkono, kuwa mwepesi wa kufurahia kwamba ni mabadiliko ambayo yanakuwa implemented eh, to better the services hapa mjini Nairobi.